former use and coach Gisika dies. Former U, S, W, N, T coach Gisika dies. Tony Gisiko speaks during the National Soccer Hall of Fame, class of 2016 induction ceremony, Carl Terra de USA Today Sports. Tony DiSicco, who coached the United States women's national soccer team to a World Cup victory in 1999, died at age 68 on Monday night. DiSicco's death was confirmed in a statement by his family, last night, at his home, surrounded by his family, Tony DiSicco bestowed love broadly as he transformed from a mortal body to an eternal idea, DiSicco's son, Anthony, posted on his Twitter account. While the health challenges Tony faced were confronted head on and with eyes open, we never could have foreseen the beautiful journey that truly defined the magnificence of this man's life. In honor of Tony's life, we ask that the emotion evoked by his passing be channeled towards the ideals he embodied, integrity, compassion and love, while sorrow is inevitable in his absence, his strength and grace illuminated a path forward without fear. We are grateful. Lisiko coached the Uswood from 1994-99, culminating in the famous victory over China in a penalty shootout to win the cup at the Rose Bowl. Lisiko also guided the team to an Olympic gold medal in Atlanta in 1996. Lisiko posted a 10588 record as national team coach. Former star midfielder Julie Foudy was among his former players who paid tribute. Tony was one of the finest to grace this planet, Foudy wrote on her Twitter account. His spirit will indeed live in us all. I smile the tears.